Alabama Governor Kay Ivey in Mobile today just days ahead of the first organizational session of 2019 with lawmakers. And a hot topic on the table is the possibility of an increase in the gas tax, and the governor supports that. Our Toy Thornton in the newsroom now with the details. And Toy, the governor is saying that paying a few cents more at the pump is an investment. Yeah, she did, Lenny. Some of the money from the gas tax goes to infrastructure, things like roads and bridges. Governor Ivey believes the solution is investing. That's an Alabama problem and it must have an Alabama solution. That we've been dealing with for the last uh, ooh, 40 years that I've been here. Legislators have been in talks about a possible gas tax increase for a while now. That's an investment in infrastructure. The main reason is to route money to help fix the state's declining infrastructure. There are several things that have been neglected over the years for whatever reason and it's time that Alabama steps up to the plate. The state's current fuel tax is at 18 cents per gallon. 45% of that goes to a state road and bridge fund, and 55% is passed down to local government. Here in Mobile, we're seeing some of the lowest gas prices we've seen in recent years, but a tax increase could change that. It needs to be lowering the tax. Some folks say they've already spent enough money fixing cars because of the roads and don't want to pay more. No, a lot of people are struggling around here nowadays. Uh, I don't see the gas tax. Now the governor's office says Governor Ivey will continue meeting with legislative leadership about this until the beginning of the regular session. They weren't able to tell us exactly how much of an increase we're looking at. And it's also important to note that the gas tax hasn't increased since 1992. That's 27 years now. Efforts to increase the tax in 2016 and 2017 failed. Live in the newsroom tonight, Toy Thornton, Fox 10 News.